A disturbing story out of Cleveland this morning. A woman was found locked in her trunk, and this morning police are looking for the people who did it. News Channel 5's Josh Boos now live in Cleveland. Hey, Josh, you know, this happened at a pretty busy shopping center, very popular shopping center. Yeah, that's right, Mike. Uh, she told police the woman that was taken said that she was taken uh, from Steel Yard Commons in Cleveland. This happened Saturday, she said, and police say that woman is 13 weeks pregnant. Now, they just released this information uh, last night. They say the 23 year old woman was shopping. At the dot store in Cleveland Steel Yard Commons on Saturday afternoon, but she was found in the trunk of her car by a person walking by near Quigley and Clark Avenue in Cleveland. Now, that person who heard the woman calling for help called police, who then came out and got the woman out of the trunk. They took her to the hospital where she was treated and released. The woman told police while she was at Steel Yard Commons, she was walking out to her car when a man and woman uh, went up to her, put a Thought they put a gun to her back, she said, robbed her, abducted her, and put her in the trunk of her car before abandoning it. Now, Mike, I've been in contact with police throughout the overnight hours here. Uh, no leads on these two people. The only uh, description the woman can give of these two suspects are that they are a male and a female. Anyone with information, though, is uh, urged to contact Cleveland Police, Mike. Yeah, it sounds pretty scary. Hopefully, we'll have a sketch pretty soon. And when we do, we'll bring it to our viewers. Josh, thank you. And this all comes after an abduction last week at this Walmart. Walmart store in Steel Yard Commons. According to police, a woman and her boyfriend got into an argument, and the boyfriend took off in a vehicle with the woman's two year old inside. According to police, the man dropped the child off at a relative's house. Now, the child was not hurt. Then police say he took off again. Now, later, they arrested him.